Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In the last video, I did an unboxing of some filament. I don't know if it was helpful for everyone. In this video, we will compare the mechanical properties of PLA Plus from three different brands, which is also a performance that everyone is most concerned about. This performance is very important for 3D printing. This time, I also updated my equipment and used the professional tensile tester. This test does not include any advertisements and is completely fair and public. Let's start the test now. First, let's take a look at the PLA Plus from Sunlu. Wow, it's so strong. I found that the machine will shut down after being vibrated. It's amazing. It has already reached 50 kilograms. Next, let's test the PLA Plus from Isun. This white one feels a bit like milk white. Let's start. It's over 30 kilograms. It seems to be around 38 kilograms. Finally, we have the PLA Plus from Polymaker. I am still quite optimistic about this material. It also exceeded 30 kilograms. Wow, it's getting harder and harder. Stay at 42.96. It looks a bit tough. Its maximum value should stay here. Overall, compared to the PLA I tested before, its strength has increased significantly. There are two variables here. The first is that I changed my 3D printer. This time, all the tests were done using my highest precision PUSA MK3S, so its print quality will be better. Secondly, I changed to a more professional tensile tester. Try to break it by hand and feel the force. It's too short. It can't be broken by hand. Soon though, it's really amazing. Comparing to PolyPro. It cannot be broken at all by hand. Let's take a screenshot and sort it out. Okay, the ranking is out now. This result is somewhat unexpected. As you can see, Sunlu is the top scorer in this tensile test. Achieving a result of 50.71 kilograms, it is truly a dark horse. Its mechanical properties can be said to be very strong. I didn't expect this before the test. Let's give Sunlu PLA Plus a thumbs up. Next is Polymaker. Its overall performance is still very stable. Except for its tensile strength of 42.96 kilograms, its toughness is also very good. Polymaker still maintains its excellent tradition with a tensile strength of 42 kilograms. The last one is Isan, achieved a very good result of 38.68 kilograms. I don't know if everyone is satisfied with the results of this video, because I changed to a new tensile tester, and I am still exploring its specific usage. Therefore, there may be some errors in this data. I only provide it for your reference here. And it is not an absolute fact. I hope it can bring some help to both users and manufacturers.